सी आई ई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट्स शिक्षा शब्द कोश ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू फर्स्ट एडिशन लेट्स लिसन टू चैप्टर टू एक्सेस इक्विटी एंड इंक्लूसिवनेस चैप्टर टू एक्सेस इक्विटी एंड इंक्लूसिवनेस पेज नंबर थर्टी सिक्स थर्टीन चिल्ड्रन विद स्पेशल नीड्स CWSN Any child requiring special attention due to learning disabilities intellectual disabilities physical disabilities or emotional difficulties could be considered as a child with special needs 14 gifted children children who are gifted are defined as those who demonstrate an advanced ability or potential in one or more specific areas when compared to others of the same age experience or environment those with high abilities can be nurtured and educated to become proficient The aim of the education of high ability learners should be transforming high abilities into proficiency. Para 4.43 of National Education Policy 2020 states there are innate talents in every student which must be discovered, nurtured, fostered and developed. these talents may express themselves in the form of varying interests dispositions and capacities those students that show particularly strong interests and capacities in a given realm must be encouraged to pursue that realm beyond the general school curriculum 15 inclusive education inclusive education means that all students that include students from socio economic disadvantaged groups and children with special needs by age appropriate regular classes and are supported to learn contribute and participate in all aspects of the life of the school inclusive education is about how we develop and design inclusive infrastructure schools classrooms as well as inclusive pedagogies programs and activities so that each child can learn and participate together 16 indian sign language isl sign language is a medium of communication for the hearing impaired sign language interpreters translate the oral language into visual manual language to make hearing impaired people understand content or information the indian sign language dictionary is available in video text and audio form on diksha digital content in isl mapped to syllabus may also be seen on diksha available at diksha.gov.in 17 out of school children oosc as per the rte act children of 6 to 14 years of age who are one never enrolled in school or two dropped out from school or three not attending school for a particular period as defined by the states and uts without informing any reason page number 
एटीन पर्सन्स विद डिसेबिलिटी पी डब्ल्यू डी एज पर आर पी डब्ल्यू डी एक्ट टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन पी डब्ल्यू डी मीन्स अ पर्सन विद लॉन्ग टर्म फिजिकल मेंटल इंटेलेक्चुअल और सेंसरी इंपेयरमेंट विच इन इंटरेक्शन विद बैरियर्स हिंडर्स इज फुल एंड इफेक्टिव पार्टिसिपेशन इन सोसाइटी इक्वली विद अदर्स डेफिनेशंस ऑफ ट्वेंटी वन डिसेबिलिटीज आइडेंटिफाइड अंडर द आर पी डब्ल्यू डी एक्ट टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन ऑफ इंडिया फिजिकल डिसेबिलिटी refers to disability caused due to physical deformities or amputations and is a limitation to person's physical functioning mobility stamina or ability to perform physical actions one locomotor disability locomotor disability means an inability of the bones joints or muscles leading to substantial restriction of the movement of the limbs two leprosy cured persons leprosy cured person means a person who has been cured of leprosy but is suffering from one loss of sensation in hands or feet as well as loss of sensation and paresis in the eye and eyelid but with no manifest deformity 2 manifest deformity and paresis but having sufficient mobility in their hands and feet to enable them to engage in normal economic activity 3 extreme physical deformity as well as advanced age which prevents him or her from undertaking any gainful occupation and the expression leprosy cured shall be construed accordingly 3 cerebral palsy cerebral palsy or cp means a group of non progressive neurological conditions affecting body movements and muscle coordination caused by damage to one or more specific areas of the brain usually occurring before during or shortly after birth 4 dwarfism dwarfism is a growth disorder characterized by shorter than average body height human beings with adult body height less than 4 feet 10 inches or 147.32 cm are considered to be affected with dwarfism 5 muscular dystrophy muscular dystrophy means a group of hereditary genetic muscle disease that weakens the muscles that move the human body persons with multiple dystrophy have incorrect and missing information in their genes which prevents them from making the proteins they need for healthy muscles it is characterized by progressive skeletal muscle weakness defects in muscle proteins and the death of muscle cells and tissue 6 acid attack victim acid attack victim means a person disfigured due to violent assaults by throwing of acid or similar corrosive substance page number 38 definitions of 
21 disabilities identified under the RPWD Act 2016 of India. Visual impairment refers to decreased ability to see to the extent that causes problems in daily functioning. 7. Blindness Blindness means a condition where a person has any of the following conditions after best correction. 1. Total absence of sight or 2. Visual acuity less than 3 by 60 or less than 10 by 200 Snellen in the better eye with best possible correction or 3. Limitation of the field of vision subtending an angle of less than 10 degree. 8. Low vision means a condition where a person has any of the following conditions. Namely, 1. Visual acuity not exceeding 6 by 18 or less than 20 by 60 up to 3 by 60 or up to 10 by 200 Snellen in the better eye with best possible corrections or 2. Limitation of the field of vision subtending an angle of less than 40 degree up to 10 degree. Hearing impairment refers to decreased ability to listen to the extent that it creates problems in day-to-day -day functioning. 9. Hearing impairment Deaf and hard of hearing Hearing impairment is defined as a deaf means persons having 70 dB hearing loss in speech frequencies in both ears. b. Hard of hearing means person having 60 dB to 70 dB hearing loss in speech frequencies in both ears. Speech and language disability refers to problems in communication involving hearing, speech, language and fluency. 10. Speech and language disability means a permanent disability arising out of conditions such as laryngectomy or aphasia affecting one or more components of speech and language due to organic or neurological causes. 11. Autism Spectrum Disorder means a neurodevelopmental condition typically appearing in the first three years of life that significantly affects a person's ability to communicate, understand relationships and relate to others and is frequently associated with unusual or stereotypical rituals or behaviors. Intellectual disability refers to significant impairment in cognitive and adaptive functioning. It causes difficulties in problem solving, reasoning and learning. 12. Intellectual Disability A condition characterized by significant limitations both in intellectual functioning, reasoning, learning, problem solving and 
in adaptive behavior which covers a range of everyday social and practical skills mental behavior includes mental illness which refers to disturbances in thoughts and behavior that become obstacles in performing activities of daily living 13 mental illness mental illness means a substantial disorder of thinking mood perception orientation or memory that grossly impairs judgment behavior capacity to recognize reality or ability to meet the ordinary demands of life but does not include retardation which is a condition of arrested or incomplete development of mind of a person especially characterized by subnormality of intelligence page number 39 definitions of 21 disabilities identified under the rpwd act 2016 of india 14 specific learning disabilities means a heterogeneous group of conditions wherein there's a deficit in processing language spoken or written that may manifest itself as a difficulty to comprehend speak read write spell or to do mathematical calculations and includes such conditions as perceptual disabilities dyslexia dysgraphia dyscalculia dyspraxia and developmental aphasia examples of specific learning disabilities dyslexia difficulty in reading due to problems identifying speech sounds and learning how they relate to letters and words decoding dyspraxia the inability to motor plan to make an appropriate body response dysgraphia difficulty with the act of writing both in the technical as well as the expressive sense there may also be difficulty with spelling dyscalculia difficulty with calculations attention deficit and hyperactivity disorder adhd hyperactivity distractibility and impulsivity chronic neurological condition this section includes disabilities caused by chronic neurological conditions these are caused due to problems in the nervous system of the person multiple sclerosis multiple sclerosis is an inflammatory nervous system disease in which the myelin sheaths around the axons of nerve cells of the brain and spinal cord are damaged leading to demyelination and affecting the ability of nerve cells in the brain and spinal cord to communicate with each other 16 parkinson's disease parkinson's disease means a progressive disease of the nervous system marked by tremors muscular rigidity and slow imprecise movement chiefly affecting middle aged and elderly people associated with degeneration of basal ganglia of the brain and a deficiency of the neurotransmitter dopamine blood disorders includes 
the disabilities caused by problems in blood or blood disorders. 17. Hemophilia Hemophilia means an inheritable disease usually affecting only male but transmitted by women to their male child characterized by loss or impairment of the normal clotting ability of blood so that a minor wound may result in fatal bleeding. 18. Thalassemia Thalassemia means a group of inherited disorders characterized by reduced or absent amounts of hemoglobin. 19. Sickle cell disease Sickle cell disease means a hemolytic disorder characterized by chronic anemia, painful events and various complications due to associated tissue and organ damage. Hemolytic refers to the destruction of the cell membrane of red blood cells resulting in the release of hemoglobin. 20. Multiple disabilities Multiple disabilities include deafness, blindness, which means a condition in which a person may have a combination of hearing and visual impairments causing severe communication, developmental and educational problems. 21. Any other category as may be notified by the central government. This is a subject to provision of the constitution. It will include any other disability whenever notified by the central government. Page number 40 19 Priya, the Accessibility Warrior The comic book named Priya, the Accessibility Warrior is the outcome of collaborative efforts of Department of Empowerment of Persons with Disabilities or Divyangachan, Ministry of Social Justice and Empowerment and Department of School Education and Literacy, Ministry of Education, Government of India. It provides glimpses into the world of a girl named Priya who met an accident and couldn't walk due to plastered leg. The story depicts how she managed to participate in all activities at school. As the school has made efforts to become accessible. In the process, Priya learned the importance of accessibility and therefore she takes the pledge of being the accessibility warrior. The comic book is available with Indian Sign Language explanatory videos. The key message of the book is everyone needs accessibility. Accessibility helps everyone. Link is available at https colon slash slash n-c-e-r-t dot n-i-c dot in slash pdf slash publication slash other publications slash p-a-w-e-1 dot pdf 20. Rehabilitation Council of India RCI The mandate given to RCI is to regulate and monitor services given to persons with disability, to standardize syllabi and to maintain a central rehabilitation register of all qualified professionals and personnel working in the field of rehabilitation 
and special education. Link of website at the rate http colon slash slash www.rehabcouncil.nic.in 21. Rights of Persons with Disabilities RPWD The RPWD Act was enacted in December 2016. It promotes and protects the rights and dignity of persons with disabilities in various aspects of life, educational, social, legal, economic, cultural and political. It applies to government, non-government and private organizations. 22. School Mapping School mapping is a micro-planning exercise with the specificity which seeks a better match between the supply and demand. It gives a dynamic and prospective vision of how the education service should look in the future, showing its buildings, teachers and facilities to enable the implementation of education policies. The term is also used for GIS-based mapping of schools. 23. Special Education Zone, SEZ NEP 2020 recommends that regions of the country with large populations from educationally disadvantaged SEDGS should be declared Special Education Zones or SEZs where all the schemes and policies are implemented to the maximum through additional concerted efforts in order to truly change their educational landscape. Presently, focused implementation is undertaken in aspirational districts and low-performing districts. Page number 41 24 Socio-Economically Disadvantaged Group SEDG As per NEP 2020, SEDGs are broadly categorized based on gender identities, particularly female and transgender individuals, socio-cultural identities such as scheduled castes, scheduled tribes, OBCs, and minorities, geographical identities such as students from villages, small towns and aspirational districts, disabilities including learning disabilities and socio-economic conditions such as migrant communities, low-income households, children in vulnerable situations victims of or children of victims of trafficking, orphans, including child beggars in urban areas and the urban poor. 25. Eklavya Model Residential Schools, EMRS The education needs of tribal children in the country are addressed primarily through residential schools. Eklavya Model Residential Schools or EMRS started in the year 1977-78 to impart quality education to ST children in remote areas in order to enable them to avail of opportunities in high and professional educational courses and get employment in various sectors. 26. Universal Access Universal provision of school facilities means that school facilities should be provided to all children in the country and that the school be within walking distance from the home of children. You were just listening to this audio. Chapter 2 Access, Equity and Inclusiveness Program Coordinator Dr. Rajesh Kumar Nimesh Technical Coordinator Bati Langlingdo Sound Recordist Shanu Muksim Narrator 
बावला कोचर गाइडेंस वंदना अरिमर्दन अजीत होरो प्रोडक्शन असिस्टेंट रुचि शर्मा डायरेक्टर एंड प्रोड्यूसर विमलेश चौधरी दिस प्रोग्राम इज प्रेजेंटेड टू यू बाय सी आई ई टी एंड सी ई आर टी न्यू डेली इंडिया